yet, but this is uh, Myrtle's. Hey, Mar Myrtle's running good. She's a Roger Dodger on that. We're on third gear here, pulling onto the. It looks like the uh, the coast Ooga Booga. Down we go, friends. We didn't think we were gonna make it. There we go. Oh yeah, the, light, the shiny lights of the Reese Ferries. Where do you want me, Captain? He's gonna put me far outside, isn't he? Where do you want me? Oh, in the inside, okay, nice one. Morgan, we're leaving. We're hitting the big city. Big smoke to Awesome. And not only that, friends, don't forget, when you've got your studio on road studio, whoa, hey, Check that out. We got, we got oh, studio lighting here. Studio lighting. <clears throat> oh, oh my goodness, look at that thing go crazy. <laughs> oh, look at that. Wow. That's incredible. So that must just be the connection, eh? Not everything's perfect on this truck. It is so, it's wabi-sabi, which is perfectly imperfect. What is this person doing? The journey begins. Let's take on this truck here. This is where the big West Coast beers come in handy. Yeah. Let me tell you that right now. To awesome. to get the gullet. Looking for love in all the wrong places. Looking for love in all. Can't believe I'm in the cab of this truck with this character. It's a you're in for you're in for a bit of a problem, Morgan. Just warning you. You think you think you you. You know me a little bit. You're about to get to know who I really am on this trip. Two weeks with this guy. You know, I don't know. And when and, and two weeks is a long time. Yeah. And there's always we, we'll we'll develop a few sayings along the way. And the first one is looking for the now. <laughs> Herons. Herrings and eagles loaded. Can you see them? I wonder if they're looking for love. Okay, friends, we're uh, in Surrey, Surrey, BC, the land of my wife's, where she was born, or not born, but she lived here for a while. We're at a fruit stand and a farm, farm thing here, but what we're doing, friends, is we're just having a, a luxie poo. And that might have a reason why we got no fluid. Because nice. it all drained out. Yeah. Because yeah, that was open. That came off a while ago, obviously. What did? Oh, see, oh so it just drained down the hose? Yeah. Yeah. Right. So we're going to time it, friends, because what happened is I was on a tree job with Hogan one day, and this thing started running like a dose of the you-know-what. And uh, I was like, well, what, what's happening? This should not be like this. And all of a sudden, I pull into the job, and I just pop the hood, and the freaking distributor was loose. So he's going to... Do we need to undo that, Morgan, or anything? Oh, no, fuck out of it. Okay. So listen to it, fire friends. It, there's no hesitation. It's just tick, boom. Watch. Listen. So that's a sign. It's the old school timing. I've oh, I've timed it by ear. So, and I took my time with it where I actually revved it up a bit and found that spot. So that will pull the vacuum and rest. Just watch your hands on that fan. A little bit more. Really? Yeah, I won't put about four or five degrees. That, that makes sense. Okay, so hang on. Okay, so my inclination going up a hill was that it was lacking a little bit. Not much, it was acceptable, but we were at zero, where we're supposed to be at about six or eight. So we're now at 5.4. So we're actually gonna notice a difference. So let's check one more thing. Good. We're getting into the mountains here now, friends. This is 
hope. Well, almost. And then, where are we? Chelwak or something? This will be coming up to Abbotsford. Yeah. But this is, as you can see here, we're getting into the, the roll of mountains. We, we're coming into some pretty intense. give you a little update on this truck I'm telling you uh, it's it's all there all systems go oh yeah all systems go rocking a nice 60 mile an hour from time to time I crack her up to about 75 when I'm sick and tired of looking at the back of a truck or something I just pound on it but I mean we're, we're into some neat we're starting to get into some nice mountains here Bertle's a champ so far. Okay, so we're, we're in hope, giving it some of this, thanks to our super chatters. Um, friends, I, I, I gotta be honest. Uh, hope is, we'll put it this way. If you've ever seen the show Rambo, this is where it was filmed, in hope. I, th I believe, if I'm not mistaken. 93 dollars 93 dollars so 41 liters here's this little gas station right look look at the crevices in this like look at this joint look at that look at that crevice right there just right rugged terrain like deadly check out the timber over here it's all really really nice in here hope is beautiful you know so, so here we are, we're starting our journey. Hope is a, it's a beautiful, beautiful place. Lots of fog in here and that. And uh, look here, look at this massive rock faces. I think they, I think they filmed a rocky film or uh, what do you call it, a grapple. Yeah. Morgan, how's things looking? Good. Good, we got our tachometer set up? <laughs> so we want to find out what we're tacking at, friends. Tell folks what we're doing here. Okay, so Buckin wanted to install a tachometer, uh, but we didn't get around to that, so, um, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> so I said, hey, I got the timing light. Let's just hook it up under the hood, bring the leads in through the window. How do you get out of here now? And uh, we'll see what we got. Yep, one east. Okay, now I got my cruise control set up too, Morgan. See this when my leg gets sore? Okay, so let me guess. We're at 2,800 right now. Is this 2,500? 25 right now? Oh yeah, baby! It's not bad. Not at 65 miles an hour. Okay, so 27 right now at 60 miles an hour. What's the matter with that? Okay, so let's let's take it up to 70 miles an hour. We gotta be at 30. This is where this is where I would like to cruise on this journey, right here, like right here. Three thousand, three grand. We're at three grand. Can you tell me if there's anything wrong with that? Friends, good morning to you. We uh, we just woke up. I'm having a black coffee. I got my Buck and Billy Ray. Get your gullet argyle on, so you you know the peace is flowing. I just just at peace. <laughs> We're in the hotel at the Sandman. We rolled in here last night at about oh I don't know what was it Morgan eleven twelve or something. It was late. We were whipped, just whipped, and we almost calfed. We told each other we want to make Calgary yesterday. And we made it. Here's a little shot of, of, a, of, a, of a fast, whatever you call it there, time lapse. Friends, I got to thank all the super chatters who have supported this journey. I think we worked it out. It's going to be about a $3,500 uh, <laughs> fuel bill. A fuel bill. We don't know. We don't care. We're just flying. We're loving it. We're in Calgary. We made it last night. And we're going to head out this morning. We got to go help out Tin Man. Uh, do some things around 
in Calgary here because he's way away and he doesn't want to fly here to check it out. So we're doing some things. I've got some beautiful footage of the Rogers Pass and some amazing stuff I'll share with you. But we just want to uh, say we love you all and we really appreciate you following along. More to come. We're going to splash videos up every day for you. Keep your eye out for the shorts and stay tuned on this journey. We love you, friends. Be kind. Friends, listen, Morgan's putting up his own videos. Do not forget to go over to Wild West Garage and check out Morgan's videos and subscribe to his channel. He's busting out of his shell. He's turned into an animal. I thought he was a calm, cool, collective dude. He's starting to scare me. Head over there. <laughs> Hi, friends. Well, I just put a shift in probably... Well, five hours? Five hours, yeah. I just put a five hour uh, drive in. We got. She wants to run, eh? Oh, yeah, she wants to run. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's 70 mile an hour is about three grand. We checked it out. Which isn't bad, friends, is it, Mark? No. But, you know, it's, it is what it is. We got a lot of driving to do. Yeah, isn't that nice? <clears throat> so, Morgan's taken over. Uh, whether I get any shut-eye, I don't know. It's What is it, noon? It's, uh, just about one o'clock. Just about one o'clock on our first day. We're heading into uh, Kamloops. She's going off without a hitch, friends. So far, so good. Is this where Rambo was built? Ramble. Yeah, Ramble. Oh yeah, Ramble was formed here in hope. Yeah. And the reason being is because you never know when someone's gonna jump out of the 